Well, got my order in today of one of uh, Mini Bull Designs stoves. Here's what I ended up buying. I bought a piece of the wick, super wick material, carbon felt wick. A couple of pieces of tubing. Saw the chopsticks. Had to try out Tini's chopsticks. The main portion of the stove itself that I will be testing out shortly. The holder, so I can perch the, uh, cook things above the stove itself. <clears throat> like the looks of the uh, blue fuel holder, so I got one of those. Got a top couple of the pot round holders there. And some extra fuel jugs with the base. And also the main portion of the cooking. It's got the big Foster's beer can in it. And it all folds up in a nice neat little container. Not sure if I got that in the video. There we go, all one nice little neat container. There's the main Pot to boil some water, boil some water, or whatever have you. The lid comes off. Nice and clean inside. Must have drank all the beer. Again, Foster's can. It's got the nice handhold on the side. It's got a rubber lid and painted black on the bottom. Assuming that's a high heat paint. I like the setup that he has with the uh, storing everything together. You've got the bottom of the Ziploc that fastens in, falls right in there. This part sits on top. Screw everything down in place, and it's nice and compact. Here's a close-up shot of the uh, compact alcohol burner. It's got the feed valve on the side. And the felt goes down inside of it. It's supposed to fit all the way to the bottom and loose fit. The fuel source and storage. Fill that up with alcohol after you attach everything together. Alright, here we have it assembled. Now, I guess the trick to this is you fill it with alcohol. You do not connect it to the burner yet. You fill that with alcohol, you hold the tube up, start to let the alcohol flow down through the tube, pinch it off, and then connect it to the stove. That way you get it running properly. So we'll give it a try once I get some alcohol in this. Yeah, I gotta put a little bit of alcohol in there. Lit up the stove. Ooh, yes it is very warm. Can't see the flames, but this on there. Let it burn up a bit. See how long it takes to boil some water. Okay, full of water now. Let's see how long it takes to uh, boil away. There's a lot of heat coming off that thing. Okay, I had a little accident with the uh, stuff there, but 
as you can see, a little over, ouch. Gonna have to put those wooden handles on. A little over a quarter, probably about a half a bottle, brought this to a nice boil. So, I figure about half of this bottle filled up will do uh, nice hot chocolate, cup of tea, coffee, whatever you're into.